O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. O strength and stay, upholding all creation, whoever dost thyself unmoved abide. Yet day by day the light into gradation from our to our in all its changes guide. Grant to life's day a calm unclouded ending, and even touched by shadows of decay. The brightness of a holy deathbed blending with dawning glories of the eternal day. Hear us, O Father, gracious and forgiving, through Jesus Christ, thy co-eternal Word, who with the Holy Ghost by all things living, now and to endless ages at adore. You are the fairest of the children of men, and graciousness is poured upon your lips. My heart overflows with noble words. To the King I must speak the song I have made. My tongue as nimble as the pen of a scribe. You are the fairest of the children of men, and graciousness is poured upon your lips. Because God has blessed you forevermore, O mighty one, gird your sword upon your thigh. In splendor and state, ride on in triumph. For the cause of truth and goodness and right, take aim with your bow in your dread right hand. Your arrows are sharp, peoples fall beneath you. The foes of the king fall down and lose heart. Your throne, O God, shall endure forever. A scepter of justice is the scepter of your kingdom. Your love is for justice, your hatred for evil. Therefore God, your God, has anointed you with the oil of gladness above the kings. Your robes are fragrant with aloes and myrrh. From the ivory palace you are greeted with music. The daughters of kings are among your loved ones. 
On your right stands the queen in gold above him. Give praise to the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and for ages and end. Amen. You are the fairest of the children of men, and graciousness is poured upon your lips. Behold, the bridegroom is coming. Go out and meet him. Listen, O oh God, give heed to my words. Forget your own people and your father's house. So will the king desire your beauty. He is your Lord, pay homage to him. And the people of Tyre shall come with gifts. The richest of the people shall seek your favour. The daughter of the king is clothed with splendour. Her robes embroidered with pearls set in gold. She is led to the king with her maid and companions. They are escorted amid gladness and joy. They pass within the palace of the king. Son shall be yours in place of your fathers. You will make them princes over all the earth. May this song make your name for every member. May the peoples praise you from age to age. Give praise to the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and for ages and end. Amen. Behold, the Bridegroom is coming. Go out and meet him. God planned to bring all things together under Christ when the fullness of time had come. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in Christ with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places. He chose us in him before the foundation of the world, that we should be holy and blameless before him. He destined us in love to be his sons through Jesus Christ, according to the purpose of his will, to the praise of his glorious grace, which he freely bestowed on us in the beloved. In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of our trespasses, according to the riches of his grace, which he lavished upon us. He has made known to us, in all wisdom and insight, the mystery of his will, according to his purpose, which he set forth in Christ. His purpose he set forth in Christ, as a plan for the fullness of time, to unite all things in him, things in heaven and things on earth. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. God planned to bring all things together under Christ, when the fullness of time had come. We constantly thank God for you, because as soon as you heard the message that we brought you, as God's message, you accepted it for what it really is, God's message, and not some human thinking. And it is still the living power among you who believe it. Let my prayer come before you, O Lord. Let my prayer come before you, O Lord. Let it rise in your presence like incense. Let my prayer come before you, O Lord. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Let my prayer come before you, O Lord. Let my soul proclaim your greatness forever, O my God. My soul glorifies the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy his name, his mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him, he puts for his arm in strength, and scatters the proud hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones and raises the lowly. He fills the starving with good things, sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy. The mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. Let my soul proclaim your greatness forever. O oh my God, let us give thanks to Christ our Lord, who loves and cherishes his church. Be near us, Lord, this evening. Lord Jesus, grant that all men may be saved and come to knowledge of the truth. Be near us, Lord, this evening. Protect Pope Francis and Peter our Bishop. Help them, Lord, in your strength and mercy. Be near us, Lord, this evening. Support those who meet with difficulty and disappointment. Renew their confidence and sense of purpose. Be near us, Lord, this evening. Christ, our loving Lord, in your kindness be with the sick and the poor, the weak and the dying. Bring them your comfort. Be near us, Lord, this evening. We commend to you all those who, in their lifetime, shared in the sacred ministry. Let them praise you forever in heaven. Be near us, Lord, this evening. At the Saviour's command and formed by divine teaching. We dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. O powerful God, since you have given us your unworthy servants the strength to work throughout this day, 
Accept this evening, evening sacrifice of praise as we thank you for your gifts. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us and keep us. Amen. May he let his face shine upon us and show us his mercy. Amen. May he turn his countenance towards us and give us his peace. Amen. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, come down on us and remain with us forever. Amen. Go in.